How's it going guys? If you're watching this, you are excited to watch me eat 10,000 calories worth of not so good food and enjoy me getting sick off of it, most likely. I'm excited for the video. I know after doing more of these food challenges, you guys are going to start to pick up on more of my favorite foods because I'll probably be choosing those foods quite often. Uh, in the future, I'm going to do more food challenges. If you guys have any recommendations, I'd like for you to comment them down below in the comment section because more than likely, I will complete them. I'm excited. I like to eat food. I can eat a lot of food. And <laughs> I also enjoy watching people eat a lot, so I can only imagine your guys' faces watching me eat all this. If you guys do enjoy the video, if you could like and subscribe, that'd help me out a ton. Thank you guys for even watching in the first place. And there's no better time to start than now. Oh, the the video won't start until you till you go like and subscribe. All right guys, so I decided to have cereal for my first meal. One because it's breakfast, two because Honey Nut Cheerios are amazing, and three, because I'm working out in one to two hours, so it's ideal to get kind of a lot of carbs into me rather than carbs and fats. Absolutely ideal. Might have to wait uh, a little longer than an hour or two after this one. Whew. Let's get started. Alright guys, that's meal number one, family size box of Honey Nut Cheerios. So I'm not going to lie, that was a lot of food, but I don't feel extremely full. I'm still going to stick to the plan, probably wait, and wait to eat again until I hit the gym, just so I don't feel too bad because I know this could make me feel worse here in the when uh, it starts to expand my stomach. So I'm gonna put the calories for this meal up in one of these corners and I will catch up with you guys at the gym. All right guys, what's up? I'm at the gym. Uh, not the most ideal pre-workout. Uh, I'm getting more pre-workout from BSN here soon, but Monster, had it one time before, probably like seven out of 10 taste. Decent pre-workout, I just need a little caffeine boost and then Gushers because I need more calories and because Gushers are awesome. If you haven't tried Gushers pre-workout, I don't know what you're doing to be honest. So I think there's only one way I can I can eat these. Alright, we got them all in there. Here we go. Alright, I'll see you guys inside.
All right, guys, workout's done. Uh, I know I only showed you some of the highlights, but I'll probably end up doing a full video on that eventually. It's kind of awkward having your camera in the gym, I'm not gonna lie. I wasn't expecting it to be that weird, you know? It's the first time thing, I'll probably just get used to it. Uh, but anyways, deadlifts felt good, squats not so good. I've been having a problem with my hip lately. So basically the chiropractor said to stretch a lot and he showed me certain stretches I should be doing and that I was a lot tighter than most people. So the plan is to get stretched out and get my squats back up because I thoroughly do enjoy leg day. And yeah, yeah guys, uh, I will probably end up doing a full leg workout sometime soon because I do get a lot of questions about that because people want to <laughs> impress other people by squatting, deadlifting, the core lifts, the, especially power lifters. A lot of, a lot of questions from power lifters. So yeah, and the workout's over. Need some more calories in because we are not quite there. So I'm thinking ice cream. Uh, hi, can I have a large Royal Reese's brownie blizzard and a large s'mores blizzard, please? Yep, that'll be it. Cool, thank you. <laughs> Thanks, it's stuck this Thank you. Just some neck control best too. Okay, cool. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Got two blizzards. And by the way, I'd have to say Dairy Queen's probably the best ice cream I've ever had. Uh, I'm. I don't care that it's a chain, to be honest. Uh, no, it does not bother me. But what we have here, the Royal Reese's brownie. I'm not gonna tip it; it's gonna fall out. And the s'mores. The plan is to start with the s'mores, finish with the Royal Reese Brownie. Probably gonna hate myself by the time I get to the Royal Reese Brownie, but it's gonna be done. We're gonna get it done. 10,000 calories. So, yeah, guys. <sighs> Whew, let's get to it. Blizzard number two complete. I will probably catch up with you guys sometime at home. I'm gonna go home and feel like crap for a little while. Uh, that was absolutely not ideal whatsoever. And I know I'm probably gonna feel worse than this in about 10 or 20 minutes. So I'll catch up with you guys if I'm not dead. So yeah. All right guys, it is currently seven o'clock in the afternoon. I'm not gonna lie, after those blizzards, I felt pretty bad. Honestly, when I have a lot of fat like that, it just kinda <laughs> makes you sluggish, lethargic. I took a couple hour nap and I've just been sitting around kind of. So I thought I'd eaten a lot more than what I did. Turns out after adding things up, I still have 4,000 calories left to eat, so Made a trip to Taco Bell. Got a couple cinnamon twists. Two mini chicken quesadillas. Four beefy Fritos burritos. And last but not least, four nacho fries which they usually don't have nacho fries, so I was pretty surprised and happy that they had those, so. It's one win. All right, guys. Once I eat this, I should have a little over 10,000 calories. I'm gonna put the calories for this meal right here. 
up in one of these two corners, not sure which one yet. Uh, at the end of the video, I plan to put all the macros and the calories for the day. Hoping I can eat all of this, because if not, then I'm going to have to eat later, and I really do not want to eat a lot before bed. So, without further ado... <laughs> That's 10,000 calories. A little over 10,000 calories. It is currently 7:23. Took about 20 minutes. That was 100% the worst meal of the day. The last burrito is what really killed me, I'm not gonna lie. But, that was 10,000 calories. If I would've done this more spread out, I think it would've been a lot easier, which I will probably do if I do any food challenges in the future. Mm. If you guys did enjoy the video, if you liked it, if you're weird and like to see me eat all of this food and make myself sick, then like and subscribe. Comment down below any food challenges you want to see in the future. I thought I was going to feel more sick than this. I more just feel disgusting and I want to work out very badly. And if I don't have a sick pump tomorrow, I'm probably going to be pretty upset. <laughs> but, it was done guys. Thanks for watching. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go sleep this off.